But one of the reasons that you always say you like coming here is not only that you get to be well fed for the day. Very true. Yes, um, but that you wanted to learn more about cooking for yourself. Yes, yeah, you know, with my schedule, mm -hmm. it's just so hard for me. I'm never at home. I feel like I'm always on the road. I'm always staying in hotels. I'm never in a place that has a kitchen. Right. I just don't have time to go get the groceries and really sit down and try and teach myself those things. That's what, you're right. Love coming one here of the because ones. you can learn something, exactly. So, well, today you're gonna get a two for one. Later in the show, I'm gonna show you you a really simple steak supper that I think you can make any night of the week. But we're gonna start with America's favorite, a chicken dinner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner, right? The expression is as it goes. You That's cannot right. write enough chicken recipes. I, however, am not going to be schooling you in this particular recipe. I do this by myself? Well, no, I didn't say that either. Oh, okay. It is a television show. We try and book <laughs> guests, Jess. Good. Um, I brought in my favorite. You just want everyone to come see your new furniture. Yeah, well, that's true, too. <laughs> I brought in um, my favorite. He, uh, he's an icon. He's had uh, more than 13 cooking series of his own over the years. Wow. Um, he has published more than 25 books. Wow. I know. I can't believe that I can call him friend now after all these years. My dear, dear friend. Jacques Pepin. If my parents knew what I was doing right now <laughs> with you, they would absolutely lose their mind. Right? You're their favorite. It, my parents talk about you all the time. You are their favorite. They got their inspiration oh. cooking because of you. Everyone well, has. I don't know you were going. Yeah. All right, you get in the middle. Thank you're gonna, you. you're gonna marry not, him. I, I don't get nervous around a lot of people. I'm actually, oh. I'm actually nervous right now. This I is know. Incredible. The first time he was here, yeah. like <laughs> now I can say years ago. The first time he no. was here, my hands were shaking off my body. No. Yes, no, it's no. true. <laughs> This is Jacques' latest book, uh, uh. Poulet et Legumes, uh, Chicken and Vegetables. And you can get it at Sur La Table or Sur La Table online. And it really is the number one research thing on our show and on any cooking site. It's just a chicken dinner. I mean, people love it. It's such a basic. Good. <laughs> I'm nervous. Jacques I don't, is I, a man of few words. <laughs> yeah, right. So what are you going to be showing Jesse today? He needs something simple, Jacques. Uh, very simple. We have chicken tender that we have now. You know, it used to be you couldn't get it, but now you can. So, you know, we're going to grill it and do a little sauce with it. So you want to put some salt pepper on top of this? Genial, chef. Yeah, you come on this side. Parfait, alors. Okay, so. So what, I, can I just be... Oh, no. That's it. And pepper. Le poivre. Hey! Salt and pepper! Gifted. We put them on the grill. Um, it's going to take like a minute and a half on each it, side. Does it doesn't matter which way you put them on no, the I grill No, I mean, you marks. want to mark them. So, yes, yeah, straight like That's this. Okay. Great. Beautiful. Terrific. So, did, did you hear Jesse bust out putting on airs and he was saying, uh, uh, what were you saying? Is that salt and pepper or? Le sel et le poivre. Yeah, le uh -huh. did you say wow. he's, he's, he's busting out his French? It's just, I feel like it just makes you sound like you can cook if you speak French, <laughs> even though you can't, like <laughs> me. So you don't cook, but you speak French food. Exactement, <laughs> c'est précisément. Exactement, oui. <laughs> Good. Can I get this out of your way? Yes, so like, okay. it's going to take like a minute and a half. And during that time, we're <laughs> going to put some, uh, well, some cilantro, put some salt, pepper. You can put that in there, some olive oil. OK. And uh, I'm going to cut some scallion for you, some radish. And we do a chimichurri sauce. Ooh. I mean, this is nice. Argentina, huh, right? Chimichurri, yes. whatever. But there, usually they do it with the uh, with parsley and, uh, and garlic. So and this here. is really something like someone like myself, he could easily make this yeah, at home. Yes. That. Yeah, right. So He's maybe... actually doing it without even looking. So <laughs> <laughs> I would suggest that you look. His knife skills are yeah. very good, I will say. <laughs> no, no, not really. You know, it depends what, uh, you know what? I think those are ready to be turned. Okay. So a little julienne of radish, it's not really. Look at that. There you oh, go. Oh, oh, Not oh, bad, oh. Jess. You didn't burn it yet. <laughs> Which is a good start. <laughs> In the first one and a good half job. minutes of this, this is probably the first time I'm ever actually making chicken here. I, I've done it on the grill, obviously, outside. All men, Jacques, inside. they know how to grill exactly. and make breakfast because they want the people to stay for breakfast. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a good one. Okay, so, you know, 
Look, are you right-handed? I am right-handed. So come on this side here. Wait, so when you cut anything in your hand, you put your hand always this way. Okay. Here, baby. Yeah, and it's your thumb knife. on this side. Okay. I'm going to use my knife. Okay. Yeah, so wait, wait. I, you, you got the knife with <laughs> my fingers, though. So, like that. Now, I could push the knife. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was just a joke. See, if you push the knife. Push, against my well, knuckle? Yeah, push the knife. If you release your hand, wherever you go. So, you can't cut yourself? No. Right. As, long, as long as you, you are, as long as you're touching the knife, I can, I can. He's a, you're a no-look your cutter. Yeah, all right. <laughs> you can be too. So wow. you want to put some cilantro in there? Sure, I can. Chop some cilantro. Chop some cilantro. Sure. Oh, a little bit, or just like this, it's fine. Hey, yeah, good. Is that, is that, Look at am, that. Am I learning? Look at that. Wow. Guys, I'm learning from a legend. Wow. Okay, so we have a nice picture. You want to put a little bit of oregano sure. in how, there? How much do you want me to put in? Just measure in the palm of your okay. hand yeah. instead of uh, yeah. topping How's, a whole lot. Yeah, that sounds that's great. Okay, okay. a little good. bit of Red hot pepper, pepper if Ooh. you want. I'd like some spice for yes. sure. How's that? Yeah, yes. that's good. good. Oh, you like nice. it hot. And then maybe you can press one of those in there. We have okay. a... Okay, we have a lime press. We have a thing like Beautiful. that, so you go ahead. Cut side down. There. Cut side no. down. Cut side down. Squish. Squish. All right. Wow. Look at Very you! Nice. This, this is a good one. I'm on one. fire right now. Very nice! Beautiful. I've seen the other one too. So is this, is this a recipe that you came up with? Uh, I guess so. I don't <laughs> remember. <laughs> Cherry. It's, yeah. it's just herbs and Well, yeah, I, I, was, yeah. In, I, was, in, I was in Buenos Aries in oh. Argentina oh, it's last so year. Right? I think I ate more red meat and steak it's, than that's, Malbec. They eat, that, that is the diet. Really. Yeah, it really is. And, yeah. and steak, when I'm steak and wine. Oh, my God, it's so cool. Incredible. A mm. good amount of olive oil, or shall we put some oh, garlic? Oh, you need garlic. Always, always you have garlic. to have garlic. Always. Wow, okay. okay, that was so. an open, open palm strike. Yeah, so if you, if you <laughs> cut the... That was like a, the, was like a, was like a mixed martial yeah, art. Yeah, you have to cut the end of it, oh, wow. crack it, yeah, and when you crack it, then the skin comes out. You're garbage. Right? He's, a, he's a dangerous guy. Yeah. I mean, with, with the knife and the... So no. See, that? Oh. see, if you mash, and then, it, it, yep. the oils come out, oh. and it's already half chopped. You just rock on top. You make that look so much easier than, than, than what, <laughs> what I do it. No, it's all right. Okay. Damn, okay. Now you want to stir it and stir taste it? it? And we have Tongs, one of those. whatever you want. Yeah. Ah, there's a platter down here. How are they, Jacques? I think they're about ready. Okay. Well, look at that on this side here. Oh, you can really smell all the different ingredients and the garlic and the, the chili simple. Everything coming out you of know, this. That's the way my mom really loves to eat dinner. Just a simple protein with a, a salsa verde or some sort of green sauce on top. Very yeah, simple. Yeah, you, you try that once, and after that, you do that with uh, a piece of salmon on this and the same sauce. Yeah, same oh, thing. With, with the shrimp. The salmon, sauce. shrimp, Multi pork, yes. chicken, yeah, any Alone. protein. Right. People will get really tired of your chimichurri. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, you know, I don't know how many times in your life you get to say that you're in the kitchen with two legends and two great cooks. Aww. But right now, Aww. right now, I, I feel really good right now. I just hope I can duplicate this when I'm by myself. Spoon your sauce down over the center so it looks pretty. Okay. Down over all, all right. of it. There you go. Look at that. Look at nice. that. Great color. You go to Mario Vitale, $55. <laughs> Mario Vitale would charge you $55 for that, but I wouldn't huh? mind, because he's got good real estate. No doubt about it. He Here does. you go, boys. Yeah, we can. There's, we can there's some of that. This Yum. one, you see the inside is just Perfect. Cooked. See, not overcooked. Beautiful. You can't, you can't overcook chicken. It gets so dry. Mm. Yum. Especially those. Mm. those Beautiful. We're going to call this, uh... Mm. We're going to... I have to call this a poulet chez Jesse. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Poulet chez Jesse. It'll, it'll be the number one in his house. Jacques, you come back all season? I come back. You come back you all season. I love you. I love you.